Hi there, I'm Frances Valentine, the founder of The Mind Lab. It's our fifth anniversary just this month and we're so excited to look back on the last five years and how far New Zealand has moved in terms of our pedagogy around digital technologies, around our understanding about the future and how we think about the different careers that our students will go into. Over these last five years, things have really shifted. The beginning we were exclusively teaching young children and what we realised for many it was the first time they were exposed to things like coding and 3D printing and robotics. But now if you look 2018 and this has become so commonplace, so many schools have created these sorts of subjects and priorities around what they're doing in digital technologies. So before we were really focused on young children and now we're really focused on teachers to make sure that you feel really confident teaching the new digital technology curriculum, but also integrating technology into any subject that you teach. The world has changed so significantly in this time. We're really looking at the way that work is structured, people moving increasingly into what we call the gig economy, so not necessarily permanent jobs for life, but this idea of having multiple jobs and having many opportunities to relearn and learn again. And so part of that is also the way that we work, very flexibly, in your regions and making sure that you have access to the best possible education all of the time. So if you're watching this and you've been thinking about studying in our postgraduate program in digital and collaborative learning, this is really the best time. We are still in the period before the digital technology curriculum becomes compulsory. We're seeing the shift happening faster and faster and getting in early and understanding about these new ways of thinking and working and studying and teaching is a really great time. We've also launched a whole new generation of scholarships, the advanced scholarships, so that most of you, if you're a public school teacher, will be eligible for these scholarships to really offset the cost of your tuition. The other great thing now is if you do the Digital and Collaborative Learning Programme, it is the first third of our Master of Contemporary Education. Whether you choose just to do the 32 weeks or continue on at some stage to do the full Master of Contemporary Education, there's never been a better time. Over the past five years, we've had such a tremendous support from you as teachers and as principals and from the communities of learning. We have now taught 1,200 different schools. One in every 15 teachers in the entire country have been through our program and we've delivered our program in 85 different regions. It's just amazing to think of the impact that we're having out there, but we couldn't do it without you, without your commitment to your profession and to your students. Over our journey we've evolved and we've grown and we've, we've pivoted as things have changed and as technology moves on and as pedagogy advances, but we're still very much aligned with that golden star that we're chasing, which is really empowering you as teachers to be the very best you can be. We're never going to deviate from the fact that we're committed to New Zealand educators and to New Zealand students. We're here for the long haul and we're really excited about the journey ahead. Come and join us, I'd love to see you.